Hello, friends, and welcome to the Million Dollar Message. This is National Sales Director Kristen Sharp with your Thursday thankful message. And today, I wanted to share with you my Be My Best personal accountability checklist. I don't know about you, but sometimes I fall off the wagon with uh, exercise, drinking as much water, doing my quiet time, my six most important things list that Mary Kay taught us, or my weekly plan sheet. Um, Sometimes I'm really strong in some areas and really lousy in others. Can you relate? (laughs) Well, I had to do kind of like a checkup on myself the other day because I have some really Big, big goals for our seminar year-end, June 30th, personally as well for my national area. And I knew that I needed to be my best to perform my best. You see, when I talk to a lot of consultants, many times they're struggling in their Mary Kay business because they don't have the energy. They don't feel good. And a lot of times it has to do with not exercising, not doing our affirmations, One moment, baby, I'm doing the recording for the Million Dollar Message. And so I have found that I perform my best when I'm feeling my best. And I don't know about you, but with my son now not being in school, (laughs) you just heard him, (laughs) my schedule has changed. And the normal times that I would work out hasn't been the same. And even my schedule of how my day works because I don't have that free time of him being in school – Everything has changed, okay? So maybe you're with me. And that's kind of why I fell off the bandwagon. I mean, I guess that's an excuse too, but I fell off. And so this past week, I knew that in order to be my best, to hit my June 30th goal, I had to get back to my accountability checklist. So I will post this on my social media account um, so you have it. But basically, it tracks Monday through Sunday. And I probably picked this up from somebody else and kind of just tweaked it to make it my own. But I hope it blesses you. Um, And on here, it has seven different days. So you'll see it has Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And there's a little circle where you can check off when you've accomplished something. For my personality, I need to check it off. I feel so good when I check it off. So it has the date, and then it checks off when you did your 20 minutes of exercise. You had your quiet time. You did your affirmations and wrote three things that you were grateful for. Because I found sometimes when things are not going so great, I got to focus on the things that are going great. And so sometimes I got to write those things down because it makes all the difference. And then I can focus on those things that are going great. On there, it um, has you do three 20-minute IPA power sessions. Now, remember, an IPA is an income-producing activity. And the reason I have it broken down into 20-minute increments is if you work another job, sometimes you can do this on your lunch hour, 20 minutes, or right when you get off work. Um, 20 minutes or, you know, for me, because my schedule's different, I want to make sure that I'm getting those 20 minutes in, whether my son's watching a quick TV show for 20 minutes or he's taking a nap or I have him occupied. Those are 20 minutes. And for me, that IPA is booking and following up live. Okay. So there's three 20 minute sessions, which really is only an hour, you guys, but it's an hour of focus time and I break it up. Okay. On here is me tracking my $100 day because it's my goal every day to sell $100 or more and to share the Mary Kay opportunity with at least one person or more every day. Um, Also on here, it's I drink half my body weight in water. (laughs) Um, And it's making me put down my weight, which I don't like, but it's the accountability, too, of, of hitting my weight goals. And then I wrote my six most important things to do for the next day. Now, please know that these are not necessarily in specific order. You can change the order of how you do these, but it's a tracking system. It's simple. It's easy. I print one out for the week. You can hang it on your fridge. You can put it in your tape book. But it just keeps me po- like focused on the right things. And I feel such a sense of winning after I can check these off. Now, do I have more things that I do in my day? Absolutely. But for me, this just keeps me in check for my spiritual, my mental um, part of my business, but also um, the health, my personal health. And so I hope that this list blesses you. Again, I'll, I'll, I'll post it on my social media account. And if anything, maybe this could just act as a reminder of you creating a system that works for you. 
based on the things that you know are going to help you perform better now, especially with the race of our our year end of being June 30th. And I'll tell you, you guys, how you finish in May, that momentum carries over in June. So I'm challenging you to be your best. This is NSC Kristen Sharp signing off. Make today a day that counts.